this event every year has given our, your senior class president, the opportunity to deliver a short farewell address, after which he'll call up the senior class officers to bestow the most inspirational teacher award. So, Ryan Carroll. First off, uh, I just want to thank Mr. Carey and Mr. Denby uh, for offering their words of wisdom to guide us over the next four years. Also, I'd like to thank Mr. G uh, for leading us in prayer today and Dr. DQ for his very positive message. That story is going to be pretty tough to follow. Uh, in, but in a special way, I want to thank Mr. Hanrahan, uh, not only for planning this great luncheon, but, but for everything over the past four years. Your constant support of all of us and, and your consistent positive attitude is something that we're, as a class, I can speak for them, deeply grateful for. So thank you. And I would also like to thank you guys, my brothers of the proud prep class of 2021, for how you've remained steady and strong and close to the unique challenges that only we have managed in our senior year. <laughs> I especially want to thank you for being patient in this year of waiting. We have constantly been called on to wait for guidelines and restrictions to cease so that we can enjoy a somewhat normal senior year. Your patience is a big part of the reason that all the events last week and this week are possible. It means a great deal to me, as I know it does to the faculty and administration as well. And now that we're approaching graduation, I want to briefly highlight all that we've accomplished over the past four years. Well, the first class to learn of the Barrett Science Center, the first class to take advantage of the McLeod Innovation Center, the first class to witness and act in a play <clears throat> in the Pelletier Quad, and the first class to have a prom here in the SLC. In our, in our four years, we've won 15 SEC titles among all our sports and two state championships, courtesy of our hockey team. We all know they should have won four, though. Yeah. <laughs> and although, and we're also the class to welcome back Mr. Cashman, now as president, and on a bittersweet note, we were the senior class to send off Dr. De Casado with our gratitude after his tremendous three years as our principal. So we really did experience and accomplish a lot. And although we may think of this as the end, in truth, I want to point out that the prep brotherhood is truly just beginning. We've likely heard the brotherhood reference upwards of 500 times over the past four years. We've experienced it in our classes, activities, hallways, athletic teams, concerts and plays, and the bomb squad. But when we walk across that stage on Sunday, the prep brotherhood does not end. It expands. Because on Sunday, we'll be the 79th graduating class from Fairfield Prep which means that we are now of the Prep Brotherhood of 15,000 Prep alumni who live and work all over the world. A couple weekends ago, I was at my brother's college graduation, and I was super bored. So I started talking to the guy next to me. And after some casual small talk, he told me that he went to Prep and graduated, I think it was 10 or 15 years ago. We bonded for the next 30 minutes about how great Prep is and all its glory. And my point in telling you that story is that Prep alumni are everywhere and we are now going to be a part of that 15,000 person brotherhood. So thank you again for everything this year, guys. It's been one hell of a ride. Hail Prep. Ben, Teddy, and Oliver, if you guys can come up here really quick. You too, Delash. Right. Caleb's not here, I don't think, right? I don't think so. All right, so we're going to present. There's actually two winners this year for most inspirational teacher. So we're going to we're going to present that real quick. The first first winner most inspirational teacher is Mr. Carey.
uh, this is very unexpected. Thank you guys uh, so very, very much. This is uh, a really, truly a wonderful honor. Um, and I mean, truly, from this, this group of students, uh, this, this means an incredible amount. So thank you very much. And uh, I look forward to celebrating with you guys this whole week. So thank you. And our second winner is Mr. Denby. Another speech. Um, boys. Was Oedipus now? No, no, no. no. Um, boys, what an honor, honestly. Um, and a great surprise. You guys will always really I'll remember you always. Um, go Chelsea. That's all I yeah. got to say. <laughs>